South Florida Museum continues making improvements to its manatee rehabilitation facility since its beloved Snooty died two years ago. The nonprofit facility is asking the state for $400,000 the manatee rehabilitation habitat where O'Neill the manatee now calls home while he gets better has rehabilitated 36 manatees since 1998. The money would pay for transport vehicle, roof restorations and renovations and a generator. The museum CEO says rehabilitating injured manatees is Snooty's legacy. This is the second time we've gone to the legislature for asking for support. You know, we're a private nonprofit, so we aren't a line item on anybody's budget. And certainly, Snooty's legacy is that, and that's the commitment by the South Florida Museum is to continue to rehab animals. Since Snooty's death, the museum has hired someone to oversee and improve the care given to manatees. Snooty drowned when the hatch door to a plumbing area was left opened. He entered and was trapped. Snooty was 69. He was the longest living manatee in captivity.